This house is like super chaotic. It has a long history with Gemini. So this is our street over here. As you can see, we're located right on the corner near the park. Super nice in a semi-detached home. So yeah, let's walk on through, fam. Here we have our little porch cascaded by some circular leaves. Here's some furniture I found from the side of the street that I've made a little sitting corner here and a little mirror that I found. I love putting it here because it just adds like extra greenery reflection. Here, let's go into the front door. The fire of justice burns within all of us, don't forget, and our little house is lovingly called Toad Lane. To the left, we have our mailboxes, and here we have our main entrance area. If you look to the right, we have our, all of our shoes, grocery cards, umbrellas. If you look to our left, we have our movie room, which is quite dim and a bit messy right now. But we have two couches in a row, so then we can all enjoy movies together right over here. Oh yes, and right up the stairs, I made a cinema board. This is the fridge that I share with Jade and Jenny. This is our common fridge with all the food we share together. And then a third fridge for Xiao and everyone else. Here we have our first floor bathroom. It's mostly used by Emily and then anyone else who comes to visit. This door here leads to our basement. Here's the second floor. This is my room. I'm currently moving, so everything is a mess. But I did take some nice photos before. First thing in terms to my room is this little section of the wall. mugs that I found on the street actually but I think they're so cute is where I keep clothes that I've worn maybe once or twice but I don't want to wash yet and on the shelf here I have my books my teas some candy some design books this oh, I was using as a cubby for my knit sweaters and hoodies but it's too hot now for that so it's empty and to this side, I have all of my old bullet journals. I have a super tall mirror, dried flowers on the side, lighter and cords I usually put in here, and just a little lamp when I don't want to use the overhead. Basket for some papers, extra mirror. Here I just have a little shelf that I've propped on top of my furnace. butt cracks over here too. Below my desk I just keep some of my art supplies such as this ice wine box for paintbrushes that I think my dad probably gave me when I was five. He loves ice wine and I love to paint. So up here is my desk area. This is seriously my favorite desk in the world. It is the Ikea Skarska desk and I've been clearing it off when my friends or housemates come in 
for some cake. So it's a nice like dinner table slash work desk hybrid. This wall was kind of bare, so I decided to grab this from the thrift store, hang it up beside my lovely Braulio Amato surprise poster that I got from Sixth Street Haunted House when I went to New York. This cushion cover is actually just from an old couch, and this little table right here, super nice for eating a meal or reading. These are just some daffodils that I picked in spring that I've been keeping because they look so beautiful dried. Here I just have the mirror that I found on the side of the street and took home. I just love seeing reflections of the window and just bounce more light throughout my room. Though I feel like I have way too many mirrors in this room. It's like kind of messing with the chi. And now this brings us to the fireplace. It used to be so ugly because the trim was all this like barf green, but I painted it all white. This is Emily's room. She's not here right now, but if I can, I'll put some clips of her. Emily's our artist in residence. Her room definitely has the most personality in the house. The artist desk space with all her beautiful art pieces and she has this lovely window. Studio Ghibli Spirited Away vibes, so cute. True artiste. take him out right now, but I think he's got um, extremely fuck up energy at the moment because he just ate. Jenny's room. She's moved out most of her stuff now, so it's super empty, but this is definitely the coziest room in the house.
just to go out of the oven and brought outside. It's half to dry. I think then it'll have a like sir sir. I can't work. I don't Try harder. Oh I like your actual source t-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like the cat from the cat return. Yeah. So cute. So cute. I'm showing them my favorite house in the neighborhood. I love this. The colors are so good. It looks good. The queen herself. Are devilish. We are sharing the jam. <laughs> Playing Among Us, and then you know who the killer is. What if the imposter's not one of us, and then we can't torture a random person? <laughs> oh, I know, yeah. Let me just play for real. This is me roasting in hell. Holy fuck, holy fuck, okay, this is scary. Um, so bad. I just coach on, but holy fuck. Chow, chow, pan. Meeting up with an old roommate today, Nivon. Thank you. Oh, cute. Oh, yeah. Thank you for your summer fresh. Of course. We even have a little mini zine <laughs> of all of our signs. <laughs> so future people know oh my God. all of the Geminis. No, this is super. <laughs> this is it's like an actual. I mean, I could die right in front of you. It's special. It's real. I don't want to know. 
Jade bought some bloomers donuts. I'm gonna try this one. Oh no, get off my plate. I'm gonna miss you, buddy. You gonna miss me? box of stuff. This room is so empty now. Goodbye sweet house, goodbye leaves.